Hey, what's up everyone, Ollie here. So I did a video a while back sharing my experience on Apple refurbished, ordering an Apple product, seeing what it's like. So I thought I'd do the same with Amazon and order a refurbished iPhone. And I've got to say, I'm pretty impressed. So when you go to the refurbished section on Amazon to look at all the products they have, they have a bunch of them. I chose the iPhone 10 because I just feel like it made the most sense. I feel like this is a product that a lot of people are going to be buying. And it's also one of Amazon's best sellers. So I looked at the product description, it says here this product works and looks like new. It's backed by a one year Amazon renewed guarantee. That doesn't mean it's backed by Apple though, it's just backed by Amazon. It says that it's a pre-owned product. It's not Apple certified, but it has been tested by qualified Amazon people, I guess. No signs of cosmetic damage will be visible when the product is held 30 centimeters away. Interesting. The battery health will be at least 80% and it may not include original accessories and you'll of course get a one year warranty. So I ordered it, it came a few days later and it came in a plastic bag, sort of plastic packaging. Inside there was the charging brick in another little plastic bag. There was also a cardboard sort of case with the phone in it and the lightning cable. And to be honest, I wasn't expecting this. I was expecting an iPhone box. Maybe I was expecting too much. Maybe I've been spoiled by Apple's refurbished section because when you order a product from Apple's refurbished section, you do get a proper box, an iPhone box or an iPad box. It might not have the original markings on it. It will say refurbished on it, but you know, it comes in proper packaging. But anyway, when I turned it on and I had a closer look at the about section, I realized this wasn't an iPhone 10. This was an iPhone 10s. Well, this was a win. You know, I paid for an iPhone 10, but I got an iPhone 10s. I'm not sure what's happened there. Maybe Amazon didn't have any iPhone 10s available, so they just sent out an iPhone 10s, or maybe they're just mixing the two phones together. But yeah, obviously I wasn't going to be complaining about that. When you look at the same iPhone 10s, 64 gigabytes, space gray on Apple's refurbished website, that phone goes for 719 pounds compared to the 269 pounds that I paid. That's a huge, huge price difference. And I feel like you'd actually be sort of silly to go with the Apple's refurbished section. As far as I can tell, there are no visible scratches on the screen itself or on the back of the phone. So yeah, I'm pretty impressed with that. The only thing is there are definitely marks down the railings, down the side of the phone. And this makes me think that maybe the screen was replaced at some point. Maybe someone was trying to pry it open and they scratched it a little bit. They scratched the railing down the side. But even if they have replaced the screen, they've done a really good job because they've used original Apple parts as far as I can tell. It feels like an original iPhone screen. It works like an original iPhone screen. I have no issues with it. And there's no give either. It feels pretty solid. The battery health is sitting at 90%, which I think is pretty good. It's definitely more than the minimum 80% that they state on the website. The overall performance is also fantastic, especially when you consider that this phone is from 2018. It's coming up to three years old now. Zipping around the UI, no problem. Zipping in and out of apps, no problem. I can watch 4K content on YouTube, no problem. It is just a great all-round experience. It's a great testament to the chips that Apple put in their iPhones knowing that they're going to last for years to come. So would I recommend Amazon's refurbished section? I think so, I'm really impressed. Especially when you consider the price difference between this phone and the phone on Apple's website. I think you'd be crazy to pay the premium on Apple's website. Now, of course, there are some benefits from getting a refurbished product from Apple. Usually the products are pretty much brand new, especially for my experience. It doesn't even look like they've been used and you get obviously Apple's customer service. Apple's customer service is just amazing. You can just pull up to any Apple store, tell them your problem and they'll either fix it or replace it right there and then. You can't really do that with Amazon. You do have to send the product back directly to Amazon. But I think for most people, it's going to be worth it, especially when you consider how much you're saving. So with this iPhone, I don't actually need it. So I'm going to be giving away to one of you guys. All you have to do to enter is like this video, subscribe, and leave a funny joke in the comments. I, th I think that's what we'll do. Leave a funny joke in the comments and I'll pick someone at random and I'll send them this iPhone. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter and subscribe for more.